Well, hello everyone. Um, in my part of the country, North Mississippi, we are getting some uh, unprecedented weather that we haven't seen in years. People up north can laugh and joke all they want, but us southerners don't really see this kind of weather that much. So um, I'm gonna turn my camera around so you can so you can see it. It is currently nine degrees. Feels like minus eight. Sorry, get my glove on. It's cold outside. Feels like minus eight. We already got some snow and ice already and we're about to get uh, about probably eight to ten inches of snow today and this is un this is unheard of around here this is basically a blizzard for us I'm not gonna do a cold start because the hood is frozen shut everything is frozen shut so I do I am gonna go check my Avenger real quick and as you can hear, it's this. Uh, it's really just starting again. We've got a really big system coming through, and you see, I haven't even been out yet this morning. I'm not going to set. No, I'm not going to set the front yard because my nieces are here and they want to play in it. This stuff is all over the road. And for reference, here's what the tires look like right now. I'm supposed to get eight to 10 inches. Icicles all over everything. All right, I think I got some icicles on the inside of my truck. Let me see if I can. Let me see if I can see him. I would open the door, but it's frozen shut. Yeah. There's a little bit on the inside right there. Surprised, honestly, surprised the windshield doesn't. Uh, the windshield area doesn't have any hanging down. Is the rust holes above the roof or above the windshield? And I'm about to double check. Had to had some slush. I could swear I had it okay. And slush and uh, what you call it, antifreeze in this car yesterday. Had to put some good antifreeze in it. See, hopefully, yes, we are liquid. And we are good. So, get my glove back on. It's really cold out here. And I don't have any socks off. My feet are a little bit cold right now. But, uh, yes, I will be, uh, Updating throughout the day. Supposed to stop around two, I think two, uh, two to two to two thirty. So I will be. Uh, you probably won't be able to see the curb right here. Let me go ahead and switch it back around. You probably won't be able to see the curb by around three o'clock. So uh, we'll definitely uh, be updated then. And I'm so glad I bought this jacket. The leather jacket insulated so I am warm at least from my waist up I don't have any thermals on so my legs are a little cold but yes the northerners can laugh and joke about this all you want about 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 southerners complaining about the uh, little bit of ice and snow they get but uh, we don't get this this is uh, the last the people that have people that lived in the south at least around the Memphis area, 
uh, and remember the ice storm of 94, that was bad. That was really bad. And uh, this is uh, rivaling that. Not with the ice, but with the but with snow. The ice storm of '94 was just purely ice. This is we got ice first, and then uh, now we're getting a lot of snow today. So uh, I will be keeping y'all updated throughout the day. And here's my brother-in-law. What is he doing? Cold start. Cold start. <laughs> oh yeah, we get to see my brother-in-law's uh, new vehicle. He is officially gone Dodge. And he will uh, hopefully, not hopefully, he will be getting my Avenger. So that's going to be, he's officially gone Dodge from uh, other makes. But yeah, switch around. Here is his 2001 Dodge Ram 1500 4x4. He's going to be changing the wheels. And the only bad rust on it is in the doors itself. It's going to be changing those and doing all kinds of stuff to it, so it'll be interesting. having my separate vehicle or just riding with him. I'll, pro I'll probably just ride with him and have some fun with him. But, uh, yeah. Oh, this this little, uh, push the, uh, I don't want to take my glove off. Oh, you, you got your glove on. Oh, you, you can? Yeah, uh, switch around. Oh. I got him, but I didn't push This, uh, pile of, uh, <laughs> uh, debris right here. It's actually a lot bigger than it looks. It's, uh, it's actually a lot bigger than what it looks. He was turning around. There's a bunch of uh, bunch of uh, leaves and uh, dirt and crap piled up against the curb right there. He hit it against his uh, front end and or his uh, one of his front wheels and drug it all the way over here. He's like he, he had his wheels turned, left it not turning. <laughs> but yes, I will be chronicling my adventures today in the blizzard of 21 basically what it what it's going to be called the blizzard of 21 at least that's what i'm calling it but i will see y'all later today we're about to go we're about to go driving around a little bit and my brother don't have any steps on his truck yet so uh he's got to hike in here as he tries to get in. Yep, we got frozen coats on the floor. <laughs> nice. Ooh. Well, I don't see exploded coats, so. <laughs> You're okay. You're okay. And it freezes down a little bit, but, but it is liquid. You wanna try out your new ice scraper? I can see it. It's just a little stuff off. Yeah. It's not really sticking right now. But I got a feeling that might change. Well, yeah, I wouldn't do that. The windows are gross. We'll leave those up. Yeah. parking lot that's going to be empty. Middle school. I know church they took and barricaded the drives. Alright guys, 
sit y'all down for a second. These are decent sized tires you got on here too. That's a pretty good grip. Yeah, we could have some good fun with this. Roads were nothing like this yesterday Yesterday morning. We can lock the rear end so it's not peg legged too. What's that? You can lock the rear end so it's not peg legged. Oh, you got a button for that? The rear? My four wheel drive. Oh, that's just for the uh, four wheel drive. That doesn't make it peg leg or not. No, it'll tighten up back there. Every time it tries to spin, it'll catch up again. Hmm. Let's see. Big tire to safe place. And he's just in two wheel drive right now, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's slick if you make it slick. Yeah. It's yeah. It's slick if 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 you want it to be slick. Right now. But if you're cautious. We had the snowfall, and now it's sleek. And then it's gonna snow in, so it's got like ice layers below the snow. So if I just well, stop, like I can yeah. stop. But like I said earlier, what if I try to stop? Yeah. But like I said earlier, people up north can laugh about southerners freaking out about a little bit of ice and snow all they want. But we don't get this. <laughs> the only the, the people only the people that are brave enough and know how to drive on it are the ones that grew up with parents or people that have driven on it in the past in other areas or here when when it's gotten bad and they've driven on it good and they've taught us their skills or people that are just brave enough to get out and teach themselves <laughs> take it sideways please. Back in the neighborhood uh, yesterday, the police had a uh, had a four wheeler pulled over right here in, in the neighborhood. You do it safe. Don't just go flying around here so you hit cars. Yeah. <laughs> Don't want to hit that one. If we just hit it. Still gain speed. Surprisingly. I said I don't want to do that. You still can speed. Yeah, it still gains speed. It's not just oh, yeah. spinning. So we actually got decent some traction. traction. Just try to get out of way, don't freak out. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen that big truck over there. Oh, look at that. That's what I was going to show what? you. Look at this Dodge. Let's just get over here like that. What Dodge? That one right there. See that one? I got my the, chrome. Uh, the black one? My chrome rails that's at the oh, house okay. are round. Those are my rails. That's my brush guard. <laughs> and that's my lift. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Let's see that last night. Actually gives me an idea. That Dodge had the uh, had some bullet hole rims. I've been wanting to change the rims on my truck, so um, I've actually thought about either center lines or those uh, bullet hole rims like I have on my old truck. So just want to change stuff up. But uh, I think I'm gonna cut this off right here, and uh, we might be heading back out in my truck to see how my tires do, because he has some really big, wide, meaty tires on this thing. They might be rubber bands for mud tires' sake, but uh, gonna be uh, probably gonna be going out again in my truck just to see if how much grip we have on regular tires. All right, we are now in my truck. See, uh, switch it to the front to see, to see how bad the visibility's got. Yeah, it was not like that. Yeah. Do a brake test. You actually got a lot of traction. up the engine too much until it warms up a little bit. Let's see if I can do something. Get 
started before you go. Hit it just a little bit. There you go. Just enough to feel it. Yep. This is still ice coming down. This is not snow. It is. They, these tires are a lot different than what we were just in right yeah. there. Those tires, you can, you, can see the, wide. you can see the snow in them. Yeah. So on street tires, it's still safe, but... Yeah, see? <laughs> but I was romping on it to get it to do that when we were taking off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the street tires are probably not safe out here at all. Well, safe to a point. It depends. Yeah. It depends on the person driving it. Yeah. Oh, that's what he didn't know that. <laughs> there he is. No, the back window's not busted out. Right there, that side window on the driver's side. Oh, okay. Like the bottom of it's missing a whole piece. <laughs> hey, a Hummer. Never seen that before in here. Maybe I'm just noticing it because because the ice and stuff. Mm -hmm. that car up there. I'm actually curious. Well, you think the camera picks it up until it turned in. Curious, yeah. Curious what the main road looks like. Mm -hmm. The one that's after this one. Yep. I'm going to head out to that. After a quick <laughs> I guess I'm going this way. <laughs> <laughs> Made about three quarters of a turn, and then, okay, I'm just going this way. I wanted to go that way, but I'll just go this way and then that way. <laughs> Good time when I was, when I was looking at Fazoli, uh -huh. and it just had a little ice, and I was in my mini truck, and I left out of the house up there, too late. Yeah. I come out, and I punched it, and it slid around and pointed back to the house, so I just went to the neighborhood. <laughs> He's like, okay, we're not going that way. Yeah. People that love how to, people that love driving on this stuff and know and know how to drive on it safely and have fun, have fun. live for these days because we don't get days like this a lot. Okay, heaters, kicking up, heaters yep. kicking up a little bit, so. I'm
of parts, or really out of parts. I am not sponsored. But every time I go into my to my local O'Reilly's, they pretty much on point with everything. Yep. Been in there so much, some of them know me by name. True story. Mm-hmm. And I'm getting that way right now between AutoZone, Events, and O'Reilly's. <laughs> Walked in yesterday and the woman said, hello, Chris. <laughs> yeah, I got to stop coming in here. <laughs> she just started laughing at me. <laughs> yeah, that's great. The new kid will do a zero to 60, see how fast she can do it. <laughs> see what your zero to 60 track is. But it's about two seconds. <laughs> There ain't no Dodge truck does that. We're faster, than, we're faster than a Lamborghini. We <laughs> get straight. Let's stop here. All right, zero to 60. Look at that. What was that, three seconds? I don't even think it was three. Not even three. Probably, probably, hey, look, about, probably about two and a look, quarter seconds. It, it stops on a dime. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> after one stuff has been coming down consistently and let's have a look at it and here it is on the sidewalk or the yard where it's not been touched let's see it is that deep And this is definitely more snow than what we have ever seen, or than what we have seen in a very long time. Let me go out to the curb and you can see. You can see the mound that's been built up next to the cars. This is definitely a lot of snow. You can't even see the curve anymore. And we drove my truck earlier this morning and it looks like I hadn't even touched it. That's just what fell today after driving my truck. But yes, that's it. I'm going to go back inside, stay warm, and deal with all this snow. I can drive on it, so it's no big deal. I'm supposed to go to work today, but my job actually said they're closed due to the inclement weather. And from the look of it, probably going to be off tomorrow, too at least but yes there it is there's the video i hope everybody else that's in this part of the country is uh doing good with uh, all the weather hopefully people in the texas are doing good i heard they 
really bad wreck out there. So uh, hope everybody has a uh, good day and I'll see you in the next one.